What's going on, guys? It's your boy, the one, the only, Love Legends here. And today, what I want to talk to you guys about in this gameplay commentary, and just so you guys know, it's Black Ops 1 sniping gameplay, something most people don't usually see um, that much in the Call of Duty, you know, perimeter, I guess, the Call of Duty area, you know, you don't really see sniping in Black Ops 1 on a daily basis. So, if you like that shit, then feel free to leave a like, but I do miss a lot of shots, because in this game it actually takes skill to snipe, and damn, that shot is perfect, I fucking miss, I don't know, but anyway, yeah, what I want to talk to you guys about in this gameplay is, um, well, this commentary is, uh, toxic friends and friends in general, and, um, my experience with toxic friends, and, um, let me just start off with saying that toxic friends, the definition is, of a toxic friend is somebody who can, they bring, they have the ability to bring you up and then at the same time put you down, they talk behind your back, um, they're like, um, they'll, do like, um, they'll be really nice to you one day and then they'll, you know, they'll say mean shit behind your back and start rumors and all that, and I just want to talk to you guys about my experience with that, and um, which most of you guys don't know, a lot of my friends are toxic friends, like even my closest friends, I can define them as toxic friends, um, the difference is that I'm one of those people who, um, and that was a perfect shot to you, just so you guys know, I'm one of those people that can handle that shit, I don't let things really get to me, but when, when things, when they do get to me, it, it really hurts me. Um, and I try to my best to ignore it all and we kind of make it subside and I, I, I go by the belief that if you don't care and you just leave it alone, it will go away and that is in some way true, but a lot of my friends are very persist like they're very consistent. If they'll keep going after you until you finally just go like, dude, stop it, what the fuck are you doing? And um I wanna know if this is something your friends do. Like what I'll do sometimes, I'll be like, yo, dude, stop that, it's really annoying, I know, and they'll be like, what are you talking about, it's just a joke, and just so you guys don't know the science behind this shit, when there's, when a person is mean to you, there's usually two reasons for that. One is because they're trying to, um, what's it called, impress their friends and be accepted because they're socially, um, they're socially declined, you know, they're kind of de degenerate in a way. That or, and this is, this is a shocking one. Some people actually thrive off other people's pain, and it's amazing that people could be still stay friends with a person like that. Like I'm amazed that I'm still friends with half of my friends, but it's because I can take it. Um, and a lot I know a lot of people can't, but yeah, these people thrive off your pain, and that it just encourages them to keep going. And so many of my friends are like that. I have like my my um. My goal in life is, as a friend is to, you know, be someone they can trust, they can talk to, and then if somebody else tries to talk down to them, I'll be like, no, like, this dude's cool, you have to get to know him and all that shit. But a lot of the friends I have would just go along with it perfectly. Like, if you have a problem with a friend, tell them, and don't speak, don't say it like an asshole, like, in front of other kids. Like, what a lot of my friends will do is that they'll, they'll, um, say it in front of my other friends to make themselves look better, like, like, they'll never say it when you're alone with them, but as soon as somebody else comes, they'll be like, Oh yeah, just so you know, you're a complete asshole in this aspect. Just to like, just to like, you know, look cool. And that's just another, like, asshole kind of move. That's a, in my opinion, a toxic friend. Um, a good friend is somebody who you're able to, like, they're able to be honest with you when you're with them, by yourself. And this gameplay is coming to an end, guys, but I just want to finish up what I'm trying to say. Um, a, to uh, a good friend is somebody who you can talk to without the, the fear of them telling other people your secrets. Um, they're people who will give you guidance, and when not even when asked, and even when asked, they won't degrade you for it, and they won't, th and they'll give you advice when you're alone with them, and not, and it's actually good advice, and they're not acting like a complete dick about it. Um, but anyway, guys, that's just my opinion on Toxic Friends. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like. That would do me good. Um, 
I'm actually gonna be getting a monitor because I'm getting a job soon so I can afford to get a monitor and I'm also gonna be able to afford actually yeah I'm gonna be able to afford called the ghost so all that sh good shit's gonna be coming out soon guys on my channel so be sure to subscribe click the like button and look out for my future videos guys in case you guys don't know I upload Friday Saturday Sunday Wednesday Ow, I just hit myself in the ear all right bye bye people